Google has a new way to blow the competition away in sustainable energy. Apple releases a new iPhone. Oh, no, and it made it on our show? Yep. And they gained 20 megawatts of solar power on this week's Green Tech Weekly! Thank you for coming back. This is show number 50. That's super awesome. Great. <laughs> this week, we are bringing you more from the Google versus Apple front. <laughs> at last check, we are at one to one. Apple came back after a glue issue and Google has been holding its ground. Google is up first with something they haven't done before. What's that? They have announced that they will be using the wind power for their next data center. They already use wind power at some of the facilities. But this is going to directly power the data center. After years of planning, they will be converting their Mays County, Oklahoma data center over to direct wind power. The 48 megawatt facility started earlier this year and is an is amazing feat to accomplish in Oklahoma because half of the state is powered by coal. Coal? Yuck! For this giant step, we are giving Google another point. So the score is now Google 2 and Apple 1. This isn't really a contest where points rack up very fast, is it? No, I guess not. In our second story, we have the other half of this competition. You know that they don't really battle each other on the green front. Right, so? So, they really only battle on who sells more phones and devices. Correct, and right, and that's coming in just a minute. Okay. Although not as powerful as Google's 48 megawatts wind power, the awe-inspiring 20 megawatt solar farm located in North Carolina will be powering 60% of yet another data center for all the iDevice gods and all the fanboys apps. As you can see from the sheer size, they went all out. But I also heard that there is a reason for the solar farm to be so sprawling. And why is that? The original plan was for them to have a large square located in Pinville, Oregon. But after some misplanning on the contractor's part, they ended up building it in North Carolina. Do we know what happened? They say that part of the bonus for the contractor was that they were given the pre-release of iOS 6 and the new Apple Maps. Wow. What? Bad joke jar? No, actually I think the jar owes you money. Ha! <laughs> yes, techies, I just did an entire show just for an Apple Maps joke. We're still giving them the point, right? Yeah. The score is now 2-2. Two two. Let's see how much more they can get by the end of the year. Thanks for watching another show. Hit the doobly-doo to subscribe. Hit the like button to help us out. And as always, remember to rethink it green. Rethink it green! The other half of this competition. You know that they don't really battle on the green front. Right? So? And you know that they only battle on who sells more so, phones and devices. If I say so, your next line was so. That I can't. We don't like saying so, so if you say right. so again, that answers it. You want to try it again? No. <laughs> Correct! The right and the <laughs> three. I'll just keep going. <laughs> In that case, let's just keep going. <laughs> three. Two.